Hi Shane and Julie, Colton with North Island Nissan of course and behind me I've got the brand new 2019 Nissan Altima. This is the base, the S all-wheel drive model. Sorry, a bunch of traffic out front here. Um, but they did a full redesign on the Altima this year and they brought it all-wheel drive as well so it's uh, pretty much a brand new vehicle. Uh, still has a two and a half liter engine. Uh, a little bit of a longer stance on it than the old Altimas and your Sentra as well so it's quite a uh, smooth drive on the vehicle. And I'll just go kind of all the way around it. I'll show you the interior because they redid everything. And if there is anything specific on the car that you want to see, just let me know. It does have the push button start, so there are buttons on the door handle that will lock and unlock the vehicle. It's a cloth interior, but it's an easy to clean cloth interior, which is nice. And it does have zero gravity seats, which are very, very comfortable. Large back seats. And on all of the uh, door handles here is kind of a carbon fiber material. It's kind of cool. Or not material, I, it's, I'm guessing it's probably plastic, just, just with the car carbon fiber look. All right, now going into the driver's side, I'll give you a shot of the steering wheel here. Uh, so it is power seats down below. Uh, of course it has power locks, windows and mirrors. And I'll start it up here real quick. Again, it's a push button start, so foot on the brake and then hit that button and I'll start the vehicle. You got a nice big drive assist screen in front, so you kind of get to pick what screen you have up there. Right now it's showing the forward emergency braking off. Um, but you can go through a few things. There's a digital speedometer, uh, fuel economy ratings, vehicle information. Ooh, turn that music down. Uh, nice big touchscreen. They updated the touchscreen this year as well. Um, so it's got all of the it's it's uh, touchscreen along the bottom, and then it does keep all of the buttons, which I really like along the bottom and the two uh, the volume knob and the tuning knob. Really like that they kept that, but they did make the whole thing touchscreen. So totally up to you which one you prefer to use. Um, then you got you, there is Bluetooth calling and audio. There is Apple CarPlay and Android Auto with this as well, so you can't can actually get navigation with it, despite not having the built-in navigation that you see in a lot of vehicles. And honestly, the Google Maps that you can use from your phone with it works way better anyway it's really cool um, it does have heated seats uh, there is the digital climate control here oh no sorry it's not digital climate control it's just got the the blue and the red there um, so you can kind of just move it with those knobs um, they got all the different modes in the middle you got your passenger heated seat there got the gear shifter on it they do have the leather wrap on the gear shifter which I really like it helps a lot with them um, keeping it clean getting the dust and dirt out of there and there's an electric parking brake so yeah, it's a very nice vehicle, very, very comfortable. Uh, I love the seats in this vehicle. Uh, and it's a really smooth ride as well. And then of course it does have the all wheel drive for your winter time driving as well. Um, if there's anything specific on this car or if you guys do want to come in and take it for a test drive, no obligation, of course, I totally understand if you're not in the market now. But if you want to come and check it out while we've got this one available, uh, feel free to stop in. Thank you very much and have a good rest of your day.